Now that you're finished programming your part, now it's time to verify that all the toolpath is gouge free. To do this, you can go up to your Verify tab, come all the way to the left, and hit Verify All Operations. By clicking this button, this will take you into the Verify engine. But there are a couple of other ways to verify Toolpath as well. Let's start by exiting Verify. For example, I could select just one operation, right mouse button click, and choose Verify as well. This will send in just that operation. We could hit the play button on it, and away we go verifying our toolpath. You could also use control or shift selection methods of Windows to say, for example, I want to select all of those toolpaths, right click and verify. Something else that's kind of unique about Top Solid, because we manage the stock so well in two and a half axis operations, for example, if I want to verify just this pocketing toolpath, watch what happens. The model loads with the stock up to date prior to that pocketing toolpath, where again, I can hit play. Now, the tools at the bottom here are easy to use. Pause, play, start result, turbo mode, rewind to the beginning. You can speed up or slow down your simulation with this slide bar here. As well, you can use the plus or minus keys on your keyboard to do the same. So if I hit play, you can see if I grab the slide bar, it goes faster. If I slow it down, it goes slower. The other thing you can do is come up to the options or settings for Verify. In here, you can include things such as your realistic holders, you can activate higher level gouge detection, control your comparison tolerances, and so on. If I go to animation, these are my tolerances I'm using for my tools. Finally, under display, I can activate or not even shadows on the part. Sometimes having a shadow on the part makes it a little bit easier to see certain detail within your verified toolpath.